the reason that people get a stair-stepped rabbit, one that decreases in width as you move across the board and you get these kind of little ridges that are pushing the blade out, it's because the blade is not set properly. This inside face that would go in the rabbit like this, this inside face is not a reference face. This face is not pressing up against the shoulder of the rabbit, at least it shouldn't be. What's setting the shoulder of the rabbit is actually the blade. Well, in order for the blade to do that, the blade has to be proud of this surface. So it makes things easier, and you'll hear some people tell you, you know, a 64th of an inch proud doesn't matter. It could be an eighth of an inch, a quarter of an inch proud of this surface because it is the blade and the extreme point of the blade that is setting the shoulder of the rabbit or the width of your rabbit. So make your life easy when you set this blade up, and this, this goes for a traditional style filister like this as well. All you need to focus on doing is keeping the blade parallel to the sole. So you've got even depth projection on the uh, right and the left side of the blade, and it is poking out on this inside face by some amount. When it's time to set the width of the width of your rabbit, you set the fence off this point of the blade, not off of this inside face because the blade will be projecting some amount. And the reason this blade has to be proud because if it is flush with this inside surface, then the surface does become your reference. And as you push the blade, the plane rather, across the board, this inside surface will slowly push it out and push it out and push it out because you've got this area of the, the plane in front of the blade that will come in, act as your reference off of this inside wall, and the blade is actually cutting and widening it behind it. And what ends up happening is the plane kind of skews out ever so slightly, but it's enough to drive it out further and further and further each time. And you'll end up with kind of uh, one shoulder cut and then another cut that's slightly wider than that and slightly wider, slightly wider. And that's where you get this stair step series of ridges. With the blade set proud of the surface, now you've got a single point of contact and the fence is determining the amount of projection into the board not this inside face of the plane. So proper setup of the blade and leaving it proud will ensure that you get the shoulder where you want it to be and that it remains consistent throughout the entire process.